Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey, hi, hello. My name is Lauren. I am so excited because we are starting a weekend in my life vlog for you guys. It is Friday afternoon right now. It's actually Friday morning. It is 1041 still in the morning. So it is still pretty early, um, but I am at work right now and I'm going to start the vlog later on this evening once I am done with work and out of here for the day because you guys, I have a long week off next week, which is going to be so nice and relaxing, but I just wanted to come on, hop on and say hello and welcome to my vlog. Time for a little afternoon snack. So I'm going to be munching on a yummy apple. So I'm gonna enjoy this as a little snack whilst I watch some Maggie McDonald. You guys know she's one of my faves. And of course, I've got my water going over here so we can stay nice and hydrated. Hey guys, I just got off of work. It is like almost 4.30 right now. And I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. I'm gonna head over to Target because I need to get just like a couple of essential things, um, just like random stuff. Like I need some lotion and I need um, like these little things that you thread floss through so that you can clean. Like I have a permanent retainer behind my bottom teeth. So it's really hard to get in with floss. I need to go and pick up some more of those. And just a couple of other random little odd and things. So I thought I'd bring you guys along with me. But right now, your gal is stuck in traffic and it's not lit. So after I get done at Target, I'm heading home. Clay and I are going to get dinner tonight um, like we like to do per usual on Friday nights. And we're going to go to Yafo, spelled Y-A-F-O. I don't know if they're like everywhere, but there's a couple in Charlotte. And I used to not like it or because I've literally only been one time and it's pretty healthy food And this was like before I was trying to eat healthier But now we are trying to find more restaurants that like we can both eat healthy at and this is one of them So I think clay will really like this restaurant. I think he's been there before he, I think he does really like it um, So I'm gonna get probably like the quarter chicken with some like Brussels sprouts and then we'll see what else they have I was like looking at their menu earlier, but it sounds good and it sounds healthy and it'll keep me on track. Target. I'm just gonna do a quick little haul for you guys in the car because I literally only got three things. First thing is the Sally Hansen Advanced Hard as Nail Strengthening Top Coat. I wanted to get a strengthening top coat because I have been painting my nails a lot more at home and so I don't want my nails to get brittle and I want to like keep them strong and healthy. I also got a St. Ives Soothing Oatmeal and Shea Butter Body Lotion. I just needed another like big body lotion to use after the shower because you know, we all want soft skin. And lastly, I picked up the Garnier Fructis Sleek and Shine Anti-Frizz Serum. I used to use this in high school a ton when I wore my hair like wavy curly and it really tamed the frizziness. And I feel like I needed another one. I had like a Moroccan oil one that I used for a long time and I just recently ran out of it. So I wanted to find a good drugstore comparison and I saw that while I was in there. So I was like, of course I'm gonna get this because I know it works and it'll be good if I do wear my hair curly again, like try and do that whole thing um, because then it'll just kind of like tame the curls and they'll look a lot sleeker. But it also looks really good in like straight hair, like when I straighten my hair oh, or like blow dry it, it looks amazing afterwards with that. So that's what I got that for. But I sprayed myself with 10,000 perfumes in Target because they had their own like new section line. And weirdly enough, like where I sprayed myself feels like oily almost. Um, so I'm kind of glad I didn't get any of those. But now I smell ridiculous because I have like 10 different scents on me. But I am heading back to the apartment now and soon will be time for dinner. Are you excited I'm home? Come here. I know, I love you too. You're so cute. Guys, I am so excited. My new planner just came in the mail. It is from, I think it's CGD London or CBD. I don't think it's CBD. <laughs> CGD London. 
and it's these creative planners. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Ah, yeah, it's CGD London. Getting a stuff done planner. This little puppy is super thick. I got the black one. The pink one was sold out. I probably would have gotten pink if they would have had it, but ooh, this is so nice. I'm so excited for this. So the cover is like, got this kind of patent leather. It's like kind of squishy. Ooh, we got a, a black inside. Personal details. And then it goes straight into the daily things. So you have one of these two double spread, like literally two whole pages for each day. Don't mind my ratchet nails, sorry. But literally these two whole pages for every single day and it's just a whole book full of them. So they're not numbered or anything. And you've got a date up here. You've got your quote of the day, today's plan, which I love that this is just big and open because I always just like to write notes and stuff like that. On the other side, you can put your breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snacks. You've got shopping lists, expenses, daily exercise, water, self-care, and personal notes. There's some, like literally, this is the ideal planner. The only thing I wish this had was a monthly layout just so you could see like dates at a glance, but I'm so excited. I'll talk more about this later, but Clay and I are about to go grab some dinner, so let's go. So Clay and I decided to get Mexican food instead of healthy yafo. <laughs> so I got a quesadilla and queso. And what did you get? The carne asada fries. Oh, and we're at Sabor, Latin girl. At least I think that's how you say it. I don't know. There's a bunch in Charlotte and they're freaking delicious. You get one scoop or two scoops? Two scoops. We're at two scoops. You can only get two scoops. All right, guys. We got ice cream too. I got butter fingers. What kind did you get? <laughs> Looks delicious. Mmm. <laughs> guys. Clay and I just cleaned the apartment and I feel so much better now. Literally our living room, I mean like my desk space is clean, the living room is put back in order, everything is dusted off, the whole kitchen is back in order, literally perfect. And then we're washing our comforter and everything and then Clay was so sweet and did a bunch of laundry. And then our bathroom, put the bathroom back in order. Literally, I told you guys just love a clean home. I am starting off my morning with my new planner. I'm obsessed with this already. I just love how much space is here for you to basically write like whatever your plan is for the day. So you could even do like your to-do list and then down at the bottom do like your different meetings or times for things that you have. So basically I have all the stuff that I wanna get done up here today. And then I already started planning out kind of what I'm eating for the rest of the day. And then over here it's got like your shopping list if you need to buy anything or expenses. And you've got like your daily exercise, water, self-care, personal notes. So expenses, I'm gonna go ahead and put over here in expenses, I'm just gonna go ahead and put groceries because I know how much it is. And we spent $30 and some random change. So I'm just gonna put $30 um, and then Clay will pay me the other half. So 
I've got that there in case I need to spend any money. Um, a shopping list I don't really need to fill out because I got everything I needed yesterday at Target. Daily exercise though, I definitely want to go to the gym today. I mean, it's over here on my little list of things to do. So I'm going to go to the gym today and I'll probably write down what I do here. Water. Oh my gosh. I probably already had one cup. Yay. Self-care. I haven't decided what I'm going to do for this today. Um, but we'll see and then I've got all this space down here I don't even know like what I would want to put down there yet. We are being so productive on this lovely Saturday morning I'm feeling good. I'm feeling positive and I'm making sure to get back on track as far as like my diet and stuff goes because yesterday as you guys saw Clay and I went out and had Mexican food and some ice cream and treated ourselves a little bit so today is all about taking a step back Getting back into the healthy routine, going to the gym, doing all the stuff that we need to get done, and being an adult. So, let's go off because I need to go to the bank and then I gotta go and pick up those groceries. So let's go. And we are back from grocery shopping. We have our four bags here filled with everything. And what I like to do whenever I do this now is I will come home and lay everything out on the counter and then I do a little grocery haul for you guys on my Instagram. So if you guys wanna go and check those out, I will have my Instagram link down below for you guys because I think they're really fun and you guys said that you like them as well, so I'm about to do that and then put all this away. Alrighty guys, it is a little while later. I've had some lunch, I've chilled out for a little while and I've got Charlie Boy here with me. <laughs> Who's that? I'm about to head over to the gym though. I'm just gonna go downstairs to our apartment complex's gym. I'm about to head out to the gym though, so I'm gonna go downstairs and use our apartment complex's gym, and I'll either go cycling or on the treadmill. I haven't quite decided yet, so we'll see, but I'll bring you guys with me. We're gonna go get in a workout, even though I'm not in the mood to really work out. It's like 12 o'clock now. Later on around dinner time, we're gonna be going to join some of our friends to watch some basketball game and probably not get dinner. I don't know, they wanna get dinner, but Clay doesn't wanna spend money and I know I probably shouldn't either. And I know it's not healthy, so yeah, that's the struggle. But anyways, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go work out, okay? <laughs> My makeup is kind of done now so I look a little more put together and my hair is like down and straight I'm going to curl my hair in a little bit because I'm actually getting ready Clay and I are going to be meeting some of our friends out at a bar like I mentioned to watch a basketball game um, so I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna do for dinner so I am over here trying to figure out what the heck I'm gonna eat for dinner because we're not gonna eat dinner with them because we want to save some money and also um, you know we don't want to be eating bad stuff since we already ate out yesterday so I think I'm gonna cook a piece of chicken honestly probably only half a piece because these are huge and I'm gonna make a salad and then I think I'm gonna do some carrots on the side and I feel like I still need something else like this is not a lot um, so literally our fridge looks so empty, but everything's up here. I don't, I don't know. We we'll probably have a lot in our pantry. I don't know what else to eat though. I mean, I don't really feel like eating or cooking any pasta. I feel like that's just going to take too long. I feel like I'm just going to end up snacking on something afterwards, like maybe some strawberries or just take like a granola bar with me. Or maybe some popcorn. Popcorn would be a good snack. I don't know. I'm going to figure something out. But basically right now I'm about to cook up the chicken. Even though it is literally like 4.20 in the afternoon. But Clay said that we're going to be leaving here at like 5.15 or 5.30. So I want to make sure that I go ahead and eat and cook everything. And then um, be able to get ready still. So yeah. And then after I do that I need to clean up my mess that I made over here. Literally made a huge mess okay don't mind the carrots charlie loves to eat part of them and then leave them but i literally have such a mess i have my ring 
everything line out so I had good lighting for once. Ugh. I just got a lot of stuff to do and I don't even know what I'm gonna wear. Oh my gosh, let's go think. I'm gonna bring you guys in here in the closet because I have no idea what I wanna wear. Oh, has Clay hung up my pants? I don't know. All right guys, I got my bowl of lettuce. Mmm, yum. <laughs> and then I've got my chicken going over here. And then I'm gonna put some ranch on my salad. Whoa, goodness, I just threw that. Just wanted to show you guys quickly what we get. If you're someone that's like a calorie counter when you're losing weight, which is the plan that I'm doing right now. Um, I like to use, sometimes things come in light, so I use the Hidden Valley Ranch Light, and it's just way less calories than normal. So literally two tablespoons for 60 calories. That is not bad at all. So I'm gonna put that on my salad. And then I've got my chicken that I'm gonna eat on the side. I'm gonna save half of this for Clay though whenever he gets back and then he'll probably make a salad too. And then I haven't decided if I'm gonna eat some carrots yet or not um, with that. I may, and if I don't, then I'll save it and I'm probably gonna do like, um, maybe like a apple with peanut butter as a snack or something like that. Or maybe a banana with peanut butter. Haven't decided that either, but I'll update you guys, obviously. <sighs> I just finished up dinner. Um, like I said, I have my chicken and my salad. And then afterwards, I decided to have a banana with some peanut butter as a nice filling little dinner. And I still have some calories left over, so we're good to go. I'm gonna be able to have a few drinks while we're at the bar which is nice and I won't feel like super guilty. Um, but now I'm going to curl my hair. This is a curling iron I like to use. It's by Revlon and I wanna say this is like a one and a half inch or one and a quarter. Some, I think it's one and a half because I like the bigger curls and it just looks a lot more natural. Also, look at this, your gal redid her nails because they got chipped and they looked ratchet. I've been trying to do them while like by myself at home lately I mean, honestly, just to save money and time because I just one of the, not one of those girls who can, one, I just can't justify like spending that much money every single week to go get my nails done. I mean, maybe I could down the road if I made more money in my life, you know what I mean? <laughs> but at this currency, I just don't think it's necessary for me. It's not like I go and do a bunch of crazy stuff anyways during the week, so it's not like I really need it. But I really like to have my nails done every now and then because I just feel like you look so much more put together when you have your nails done. So I've just been trying different things by myself. Oh yeah, this is a look, I'm just saying. Um, so I've been trying to do them myself at home and I'm kind of liking them. I did kind of a uh, squared top on them, which I normally don't do. Normally I just keep my nails rounded and actually really like it because then I feel like they look like a nail salon person did them rather than just me at home. I don't know anything crazy, like I don't hold it or anything. I just wrap it in the clamp. I kind of leave some of the ends out so they're not super curled and I just let it go, I just let it down. And then I'll hairspray it and I'll flip my head over and shake it all out and do that kind of stuff um, just to kind of give it some volume and some texture and so it stays, especially because I just blow dried my hair. I'm nervous um, now that I blow dried it straight that it's not gonna wanna curl as well. So we're gonna hope that that is not the case. But I will update you guys after this is done. I just finished getting ready and we are actually going to watch the Carolina versus Duke basketball game. If you guys don't know, we live in North Carolina. So you're either a Tar Heel fan or you're a Duke fan and we're Tar Heel fans. So I picked out a light blue and white striped little blousey top. I'll show you guys actually in the mirror. Picked out this really cute little blue and white striped top. It kind of has um, like a pleat just like right here in the middle. Um, I don't know, but it's got like a nice neckline and it is a tank top, so it's sleeveless. But I tucked it in because it's pretty long. It's kind of like tunic length almost. Um, and then I paired it with this white long sleeve cardigan from Marshalls. Actually the top, I don't know where this is from because it's thrifted. But yeah, I found it at a thrift store. But this sweater is from Marshalls, but it's long and has a nice slit down the side so it doesn't kind of like get 
totally lost in your body. You still have some shape and some movement to it. And then I have on my favorite pair of jeans. These are from American Eagle. They are the high rise jegging and they have really cute little button detailing. And then they have a ripped knee, like literally all the way across, super cute. And then they also have the like raw hems, which of course I love as well. And then I'm not sure what shoes I'm gonna wear, probably just black booties um, to be simple, but I figured this was kind of cute and subtle look for where we're going. We're going to a bar called Hoppin. If you guys live in Charlotte or you know the area in Charlotte, um, it's just like a self-serve bar. So this place is self-serve which means you basically get like a wristband when you first get there and then you swipe your wristband on the different little um, like knob handle things and then you just pull down whatever beer or cider or wine you have or what you want and that's your drink and you get limited to like three drinks I think it is and then you have to go back to them because obviously like North Carolina alcohol laws and stuff like that they just have to make sure you're not getting too much to drink um, but it's really cool and we love going there and it'll be really fun for the game I know the boys went there um, a couple weeks ago for the game as well so it should be fun um, I ended up just like I said curling my hair and as you, you guys can see a little better now um, oh, actually maybe not my hair is literally so freaking dark it's hard to even see so i'll just turn up my brightness so you guys can see um but yeah it's just kind of a light light curled a little bit messy nothing crazy and then as far as accessories goes i'm obviously wearing my apple watch and my engagement ring <laughs> and then i have on these little gold hoops i honestly don't know where these ones are from but i will link similar ones down below and then i also have on this ring here i don't know if i did a vlog on this or not but this is actually one of those like replica cartier rings from amazon everybody's been talking about like the amazon um, designer dupes and so i picked this up and it was like 12 dollars. it looks so real anyways i'm really looking forward to going i'm waiting on clay to get back from the mall right now he went to go shopping with his buddy connor who came over last night and hung out with us so once he's back which he should be back like any minute he said is they should be back at 5 30 it's 5 27 he's gonna quickly eat something and then we are going to roll out hey guys it is sunday morning now about to open up the blinds get some sunshine going in here i have just been laying around being lazy this sunday and quite honestly that's one of the best ways i feel like to spend a sunday that and attempting to be slightly productive but i'm not doing that right now i'm literally just being lazy like over here i literally have i'm about to go sit in the bed and watch um some youtube videos on the ipad but of course i've got my big glass of water ready to go just kind of hanging out and chilling um we're not doing much of anything today and i probably the only thing that i'm probably going to be doing today is really just editing and uploading a video since it's sunday and you guys know i upload videos on sunday and wednesdays so that's what i'm working on i literally made such a mess yesterday of our apartment i mean literally do you guys see this look how messy our living room is and then look at my desk holy cow look how messy it is over here i have so much cleaning to do and i've made a mess of the island again i literally cleaned this like two days ago um so yeah i'm gonna avoid cleaning and doing anything responsible for right now and then probably around like two o'clock i'm gonna finish editing my video and make sure that gets uploaded and ready to go for around 5 p.m all right guys a little while later i am almost done with this video for today i've got it all edited out and you know added all the little pop-ins and things i just did the voiceover and now i'm going to add in music and then just adjust the levels for the music and stuff for like when i'm talking and not and then it will be good to go and i'm going to upload it to my channel and of course i've got a little charlie bug over here just hanging out with me while i edit oh bud you good boy he is so sleepy <laughs> I am feeling so much better though because I just did a quick little pickup around the apartment because things were just all out of whack and out of order because I was just a hot mess yesterday while I was trying to get everything ready and, and get ready to go out. So I picked up everything. My video right now is over here uploading to my channel. Yeah, I'm feeling really good. I'm feeling a lot more productive than I was this morning. This is definitely going to be like a super lazy, don't do anything kind of day. And now I feel like I'm already being pretty productive. 
my video should be good to go at five o'clock which i think will be good because it's a sunday night cleaning routine and it's sunday so hopefully people will be looking for a little bit of inspiration as they go into their evenings so that's what i'm gonna hope for yes charlie is barking because he just got like a second of energy he's literally been so quiet all day long and then, of course as soon as i film he just can't help it he has to bark why are you barking so much hmm why are you barking so much today i know you spoiled spoiled rotten all right guys so i just finished making my little thumbnail design and I like to use Procreate on the iPad to make mine. So I just did two photos and then the paintbrush swatch over top because then it can be my color and whatever size and style I want. And then I went ahead and sent that over to my computer. And as you guys can see, this right here is how much my video is finished uploading. So I'm just going to sit back, relax, and enjoy myself. Hey guys, what's up? I know my hair is crazy. We're just gonna ignore that for a minute because I totally forgot to shut off the vlog from last night. It is now Monday afternoon and Charlie's getting mad at me because I'm vlogging. As always, my hair is a mess because I have literally been back here filming the next video that I have coming up on my channel. And I'm really, really excited about it. I decluttered and spring cleaned that entire coat closet and reorganized it and everything. And you guys will see that video on Sunday. So make sure you go and check it out whenever it uploads, depending on when you're watching this video. But yeah, I just wanted to come on here and say thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed seeing a little sneak peek into my life and what Charlie is literally sniffling the camera. A little sneak peek into my life and what my weekend was <laughs> was like i really hope you guys enjoyed the vlog if you did make sure to give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel you guys can do that by clicking the little red subscribe button right down below p.s i do have a couple more vlogs like this one um i filmed a weekend in my life not too long ago so i will link that one down below for you guys if you want to go and check it out otherwise there will be some video suggestions at the end of this one so if you guys want to go and watch more you totally can and without further ado guys it's gonna bring us to the end i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you all in my next one bye guys